Hello and welcome to the session. In this session, we will discuss a question which says that if f and g are real functions defined by f of x is equal to x square minus 1 and g of x is equal to 2x plus 3, then find first part f to 3 plus g of minus 2, second part square root of f of 2 over g of 2, third part 2f minus 3g the whole of 4. Now let us start with the solution. Here f of x and g of x is given to us. So given f of x is equal to x square minus 1 and g of x is equal to 2x plus 3. Now let us start with the first part. Now f of x is equal to x square minus 1. Therefore, f cube x will be equal to f of x whole cube which will be equal to x square minus 1 whole cube. Now f cube 3 will be equal to, now here, replacing the value of x by 3, it will be 3 square minus 1 whole cube. So this implies f cube 3 is equal to 9 minus 1 whole cube, which is equal to 8 cube, which is equal to 512. Also, g of x is equal to 2x plus 3 therefore g of minus 2 now here replacing the value of x by minus 2 it will be 2 into minus 2 plus 3 which is equal to minus 4 plus 3 which is equal to minus 1 now we have to find f cube 3 plus g of minus 2. So this is f cube 3 and this is g of minus 2. So this will be equal to 512 minus 1 which is equal to 511. Now let us start with the second part. In the second part we have to find square root of f of 2 over g of 2. Now we have f of x is equal to x square minus 1. Therefore, f of 2 will be equal to, now replacing the value of x by 2, it will be 2 square minus 1, which is equal to 4 minus 1, which is equal to 3. Also, g of x is equal to 2x plus 3. Therefore, g of 2 will be equal to, now replacing the value of x by 2 here, it will be 2 into 2 plus 3, which is equal to 4 plus 3, which is equal to 7. Therefore, square root of f of 2 over g of 2 will be equal to, now f of 2 is 3 and g of 2 is 7, so it will be equal to square root of 3 by 7. Now let us start the third part. Now in the third part, 2f minus 3g the whole of 4 is equal to 2 into f of 4 minus 3 into g of 4. Now again, f of x is equal to x square minus 1. Therefore, f of 4 will be equal to 4 square minus 1 which is equal to 60 minus 1 which is equal to 15. And g of x is equal to 2x plus 3 therefore g of 4 will be equal to 2 into 4 plus 3 which is equal to 8 plus 3 which is equal to 11. Now 2 into f of 4 minus 3 into g of 4 will be equal to now putting the values of f of 4 and g of 4 here, it will be 2 
into 15 minus 3 into 11 which is equal to 30 minus 33 which is equal to minus 3. So this is the solution of the given question and that's all for this session. Hope you all have enjoyed the session.